Hello, ladies and gentlemen. We are back with another video, and wow. Karma is a bitch, okay? Let me tell you. Twitter blocks verified accounts from posting after hacker hits high profile users, Los Angeles Times. Yes, folks, it is 6.57 Missouri time on a Wednesday, and Twitter has been hacked. They have been... Uh, let's jump in here, okay? So y'all know what's going on. I'm running this as a short video today. After the Twitter accounts of Barack Obama, Joe Biden, Kanye West, Elon Musk, among other famous YouTubers, were hijacked to solicit Bitcoins Wednesday. The social media service company temporarily blocked verified users from posting messages. Affected Twitter handles also include those belonging to Bill Gates, Michael Bloomberg, Jeff Bezos, as well as corporate accounts for Apple and Uber. The account sent out tweets promising to double the money sent by anyone via Bitcoin. Cybersecurity news platform, the Hacker News, said the Bitcoin account involved had already received nearly $55,000. Yeah, folks, it couldn't have happened to a better group of people. Most of your blue check marks on Twitter are authoritarian liberal fucknuts who want to go out there and take away your God-given right to free speech. All right. Most of these plat social media platforms, they're modern day town squares where you can go on there and you should be able to voice your opinion. Unfortunately, Twitter likes to go in there and they like to unperson and remove anybody with a dissenting opinion that they don't agree with. I.e., if you're a pro freedom, gun loving, beer chugging, want to be free, buy what you want and say what you want about everyone American who doesn't love communism, who wants to be free and left alone, they hate your guts. Well, now they're experiencing some censorship, unfortunately. We are aware of the, of the security incident impacting accounts on Twitter. The company tweeted, We are investigating and taking steps to fix it. We will update everyone shortly. Twitter also said users may be temporarily unable to post updates or change their passwords. <laughs> Y'all have no accounts now. I think this is hilarious when a guy like Michael Bloomberg has his entire Twitter account completely shut down. Now, there is some problems with this. Apparently, uh, Donald Trump, our president, Donald Trump, is unable to speak right now. I would suggest all of us deplorables, though, get up on the Internet right now and voice our support for at real Donald Trump. You know, even though he can't speak, we will speak for him. Go out there, tag the president, say America is going to be great again, and tag the president of the United States in there and let your voice be heard today because your voice will be heard. You're the only one talking right now. Everybody else has been shut up. Everybody else has been shut down. We ain't got these idiots. We're, we're not having to compete with them. So the algorithm's going to have to put up whoever is talking. And unfortunately, the blue check marks are not talking right now. So the ghosting system probably will be affected as well. This means that all of us are probably going to be able to bypass, you know, the, um, what is it? The, uh, ghosting censorship that they do where they, they don't completely cut you off of Twitter. They just, you know, push your tweets down to the bottom. Guess what? We're the only ones on here now. Our, we're not verified check marks. We'll be put to the top because the verified check marks have been shut down. All right. This is awesome. Twitter shares decline 3.8% after the market closed, hurting them. Thank God. I love that. In the early days, as the popular service with celebrities and news outlets, Twitter was frequently targeted by hackers and account takeovers were common. At one point, a group calling itself the Syrian Electronic Army was able to gain control of the accounts of then-President Obama, the New York Times, and Associated Press, and The Guardian. And this basically talks about other times that these... Um... Oh, wait. Hold up now. Hold up. We may need to do a retraction here. After restoring Trump's account... Oh, okay, 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 okay. Oh, wait, no, no, no. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. After they're talking about the 2007, 2017, where a contract worker in Twitter's Trust and Safety Division used his access to briefly deactivate the personal account of President Trump. After restoring Trump's account, Twitter said it... It had put in place additional safeguards to prevent this from happening again. I didn't see this last line. Trump's account was not among those compromised in Wednesday's attacks. <laughs> One more. <laughs> so, so not only have the pro-censorship people been censored, 
But the president of the United States has not been censored, ladies and gentlemen. Our boys at 4chan, I'm going to say that the boys at 4chan have done it again. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say unofficially, they may be responsible for this hack. Um, this may, this, this seems like something 4chan would do, okay? It sounds like something, it sounds like an extreme move by 4chan. They're like, let's flex our hacker muscles, boys. Let's show Twitter, Bloomberg, and, and Bill Gates and all of them what we can do. We're going in there. The 4chan's going to take you down, boy, and we're going to shut you up. Oh, yeah, this is awesome. So the president's account is not compromised, meaning he can still tweet. Everyone, tweet your support of Donald Trump. Tweet election stuff for Donald Trump, okay? this The, the deplorables are running. Hashtag running the asylum. If you liked the video, comment, subscribe, and if you enjoyed it and you want to uh, so, uh, 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 subscribe if you're new, and like if you enjoyed the chan uh, enjoyed the video. Also, hit the bell for notifications so you can hear about this stuff as it comes out. I'm going to try and get videos out when they happen. But dadgum, folks, stay safe, stay frosty, and enjoy your free speech on Wednesday, ladies and gentlemen. I'm the Last Raider. Have a good day.